Welcome to the IBM Smart Cloud F5 Big IP Load Balancer Content Pack Demo Video. This is the user interface of Smart Cloud Orchestrator. This content pack offers various scenarios to register load balancer device, discover load balancer device, create and manage load balancer instance, and create and manage load balancer policies. As an example, the steps required to create a load balancer instance are depicted in this video. Prior to this creation of an instant, register and discover the load balancer device. For registering and discovering the device, you must first register them as self-service offerings. Then it must be run in the self-service menu. Only after these steps are done, a load balancer instance can be created. In self-service offerings, a self-service offering is created and is named as create load balancer instance. In the process field, Create load balancer instance business process definition is selected. All the human services associated to this process are displayed in the user interface list. The create load balancer human service is selected in the user interface. This human service provides the necessary UI when the action is run from the self-service menu. Here, the host is already registered and discovered, but is not shown in the scope of this video. This offering is run from the self-service menu page. A user interface is displayed wherein all the necessary details to create a new interface are collected. As a first step, the load balancer host device is selected. In the create load balancer instance page, the details of the new instance are entered. VLANs that are used in this content pack are defined in the smart cloud orchestrator. If no VLANs are defined in the smart cloud orchestrator environment, then 0 is the default value of VLAN. If VLAN ID is 0, then the value of root domain ID is also 0. This is because the root domain ID with value 0 represents a non-isolated traffic in the device. You can monitor the status of your operation in the My Requests menu page. The Start icon moves the operation from running state to successfully completed state. With this, we come to the end of this video. For this content pack and necessary documentation, visit the IBM Marketplace.